listener. Hey, it's me. Uh, can we talk for a second? Listener? Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna come in, okay? Hey. Uh, listener? Hey, 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 shh, hey, what? What's wrong? Hey, 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 shh, shh, hey, it's, here, come here, come here. It's okay, it's okay. Shh, you're okay, you're okay. I got you. Shh, shh, shh. it's okay, it's okay. I got you, I got you. Shh, hey, listener, listener, calm down, calm, calm down, calm down. Look, look at me, look at me. Take deep breaths, okay? Breathe in and breathe out. Just keep going, okay? But not so fast, okay? There you go, there you go. Are you okay? What's wrong? Something happened today? What happened? Um, hey, uh, do you need me to close the door? So, uh, Mito won't hear? Okay. Um, hold on. I'll close it, okay? Okay, just sit on the bed. Here, come on, get up. You don't deserve to be on the ground like that. Come on, get up. Here, sit right here. So what happened? It was with a person? Okay. What happened? Oh, really? You got backstabbed? Uh, how? I'm sorry to hear that, but how? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Right, right, right. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Oh my, oh my god. That's, that's horrible, listener. I, I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Hey, hey, shh, shh. It, it's okay. Here, you, you can cry on my shoulder. I'm here for you. It's okay. Just let it all out. I got you. All the pain out. It's okay. Mm hmm. Oh, it's okay. I don't got a problem uh, hugging you. It's okay. You're my best friend. I, I'm here for you. Listen, I'm so sorry that happened to you. Did anything else happen or no? Just that? Okay, okay. It's okay. It's okay. I, I understand you're hurt. I understand. Trust me. I I've been never I've been there done that before plenty of times. But it's not about me right now. Hey, look at me. It's okay. You may not think that it's okay, but everything is going to be fine, listener. And plus, it's their lost. They are the ones who fucked up, not you. Okay? And trust me, there's plenty of backstabbing motherfuckers out there. Excuse, excuse my language, but you, you get it. But even though they did it, and even though it hurts you, I'm here for you. I'm here for you day and night, all the time. 
That's what best friends for, right? Yeah. I'm always here for you. Well, even though you did feel alone, at least I'm here. Even though we haven't seen each other in a while, I still love you. And I still say that you're my best friend. Hey. Even though you don't really have that much people in your life, I'm here. Me and my auntie. The two of us are here for you. And we won't let anything bad happen to you. And we won't let anyone or anybody hurt you. And I don't give a damn who it is. We love you and we're here for you. Okay? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. No, 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 shh, shh, hey, hey, it's okay. You, you don't have to apologize, it's fine. Just let it out, I'm here for you, okay? You're okay. I got you. I know, I know, I know it hurt you. I understand your pain. Trust me, I, I understand it. I'm so sorry. I really am. I'm, I'm very sorry. Mm hmm. Just try not to cry too, too much. You're going to get sick. But I understand it hurts. I understand. But please be careful. Hey, look at me. Deep breaths, okay? Is there a lost listener? Not yours. Okay? There wasn't really a good friend to you. So, negative people has to be pushed away out of your life. Yes, you may not want to lose them, but it's for the best. And sometimes people do come and go. And then they end up coming back. So, they might come back crawling for you, listener, but me personally, I wouldn't take them back. I wouldn't have them in my life if they did all that to you. Yes, it's fine giving people a second chance, but I feel like if you do, then they're automatically going to do the same exact thing again, over and over again. And I don't care if you give them two, three, four, five chances they're going to end up doing it again and again. And that's going to hurt you even more. So, leave those toxic people alone. Have positive people. Like me. I'm your only friend. Your only best friend. I'm pretty sure. But, I love you and I'm here for you. And I won't, I won't let anything bad happen to you. And I will never, ever hurt you. Ever. Okay? And I know you'll do the same for me, right? Exactly. You're an amazing person, listener. Okay? You may think people are better than you, but they're not. But you're better in your own way. Yes, that person may be pretty in your, in your opinion. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl, but... You may think that. You may think that they're better than you. You may think that they have something going on in their life, but they really don't. If they did that to you, that's no. But you have something going for you, listener. And trust me, in my opinion, big things are going to come up in your life. You're going to be blessed with many blessings. And you're a beautiful, listener. I don't know if anyone told you that, but as your best friend... You're beautiful. Yeah, your features, your appearance, your personality, everything about you is perfect. And you're a perfect listener. You may not think that, but I'm telling you, it's true. Even my auntie, even my auntie said it. 
Yeah, she did. I'm being serious, listener. You know I would never lie to you. It's not what a friend does. Okay? It's okay. It's okay. You're gonna be okay, okay? You're safe with us, so... We're here for you, okay? Hmm? Yeah, I did say that happened to me before. Plenty of times to the point. I don't really have that much friends, well, except... Only have one best friend. Well, actually, three. You remember Kilo, right? And Krabby Cut and Leorio? Well, I don't think you met Krabby Cut and Leorio. But you did make Kilua. Yeah. Hey. I'll tell you this. Well, my auntie is gonna go see her friend to um to Las Vegas tomorrow. So it's just gonna be me and you. But how about this? How about me and you can sneak out, go to the airport, and then we could visit Kilua. I know exactly where he lives. Him and his little sister. Uh, he don't really live with his family anymore because, well, he don't really talk to his family anymore. So, him and Luca lives on their own now. Yeah, they they live in California. Yeah, they live in all the way California. To be honest. I don't really want to live in Virginia anymore. Not really. I always want to live with Kilua, my best friend. California is way better than here, to be honest. Yeah, of course we could. Yeah, of course. Of course Kilua knows you. Well, I'm pretty sure he remembers you. But if you don't, I'm pretty sure he'll he'll remember. I'll remind him. But we can surprise him. You don't gotta know. We could just surprise him and his little sister. Mm hmm. Yeah, of course. We can do that tomorrow. Well, in the middle of the night, because my auntie does leave at 1 o'clock in the morning. So, when the time comes, once we leave, and I could just wake you up. We could pack our bags and then we could just hide it in the closet so auntie wants to be so curious, you know? Because if she finds out, then, I don't know, we'll probably get in trouble. But, it's whatever. But if she does find out, I could just explain. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure she won't because she's going to be gone for two months. So, we'll be fine. Yeah, and she has family up there, too. From where she's going, Las Vegas. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Here, here's some tissue, listener. Uh, here, wipe your face. You okay? Okay. Here, come on, give me a hug. <sighs> Why are you thanking me? Oh, hey, it's, it's no problem. I'm always here to help you. You don't have to thank me. I'm glad I can help you. Are you feeling any better? Okay. Just a little bit. Hey, to make you feel even more better, maybe you could go to the coffee shop with me? I mean, I plan on going, and then I was going to ask you until I found out you were crying. So, I mean, you know you don't have to go with me. But I could bring you something. Or if you want, you could come with me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Really? Okay, cool. Uh, I already told my auntie. And she asked, was I going to take you? So I told her... Uh, I probably will if you want to come with me. But since you say yes, then come on, we can go. We can ride our bikes there. 
Yeah, auntie does not trust me driving her car. But I already know how to drive, but I don't Fuck it. But come on. Here you go, listener. Mm hmm, no problem. Do you want to eat outside or do you want to eat inside? Inside? Yeah, because it's hot as hell outside. Okay. Are you starting to feel better now? Okay, okay. Damn, this shit, bless him, bless him. Mm. Want some? Damn, more for me. Mm. This right here, bless him, bless like, Oh my gosh. I gotta make me some of those. God damn, listeners are good. <laughs> damn. Anyways. Bro, listener, guess what happened while you were asleep? Okay, so I was on my phone, right? And then, pretty much, um, Mito, uh, she was on the phone with someone. I don't know if it was her friend or what. And then, pretty much, she was laughing. Like, I wouldn't say laughing, but she was, like, giggling. But she was getting, like, someone flirted with her or something. And then... I looked because the way she was giggling and then she was like oh my gosh you are so funny oh my gosh i just love the way you sound I, and then i said to myself who are you talking to right now like miss girl who got show attention because girl to the way how you laughing right now girl but it's true it's true i don't know if she went to las vegas to visit her family and friends or probably that person who she was talking to. I I am not really sure. I was gonna do something. Got no business. Cause this girl thinks she's grown. Ugh, we'll, we'll, listen, we'll, we don't speak of that. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh Lord, help me. Oh my gosh, this girl thinks she's grown. But anyways. Speaking of the damn devil. Hold on, it's her. Hello? Oh, nothing. Me and Lister just went to the sweet shop and got some snacks. Yeah, I told you that already. You you forgot? Wow, auntie. You got bad memory. Okay, sometimes not. Not all the time. <clears throat> no, we didn't get you anything. We wasn't thinking about you. No, auntie. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We got you something. Yeah, we're bringing it to you once we leave from here. Mm-hmm. Oh, watch this. Watch this. Auntie, uh... I know we're not supposed to be outside late, but is it okay if me and listener could go late night bike rat riding? Please. They, earlier they needed my comfort, so I'm trying to make them feel better. Pretty please. With cherry on top. I'll do every chores you tell me to do, even though I do do chores, but I'll do everything. I'll do anything. Please, please. I'll give you a sticker. Pretty please. Like, auntie, please, like, please. I, I will literally give you a sticker. I'll, I'll give you cherry on your ice cream top. Please. Oh, <gasps> yes. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Love you, auntie. Mwah. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 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 She said yes. Hey. But first, she told me to, uh... She just sweets her. Then we could go late night bike riding. Because it is getting kind of late. But, yeah. At least she said yes. How long did she say we could stay out? Oh. I don't know. Nothing about that. But maybe let's not remind her, I guess. Well, she probably, she'll probably she'll probably text. I'm not really sure. But we stay out a little longer. Because, to be honest, all I do is just stay in the house. I don't really go anywhere because going is too dangerous. So I, I might have to talk to her about that. Hopefully it won't be any conflicts, you know. Yeah. But anyways, this right here is blossom blossom. 
Okay, I'm, I'm done. I should get more, but that's that's too fat. But listen, I'll do anything for food. Literally. Like, you, you know me, listener. You know me. You know I'll do anything for food. Not saying I'm fat, but I'll do anything for food. Like, literally, food is literally my therapy. Well, riding bikes, then... Well, no, 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 no. I take that back. Food, then riding bikes. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. That's my favorite things to do. And go fishing. Yeah, go fishing is the best. Maybe you should go fishing one day, unless you're not allergic to fish. Well, well we're just fishing. I'm not saying you don't have to eat it if you if you don't like fish or if you're allergic to fish, then of course do not eat it. But if you like fish and if you're not allergic, then you can eat it. Of course. Maybe one day. Yeah. Thanks for spending time with you. Of course. L listen, what what did I tell you? You don't have to thank me. I love you so much. You really made me happy. You're the best friend I ever had. You and Kiwa. <laughs> Alright, come on. Let's get out of here. Let's hurry to just auntie and then me can have more fun, okay? Okay, come on. Let's go.